name is Brian Bottrett. I live here in Oxford. I've heard people angry because they've signed a lease for $5 an acre when some had signed leases for $2,400 an acre. I've heard people complain that they signed easements for $3 a foot because some have signed it for $27 a foot. Right or wrong, they were personal choices. At the last Oxford Town Board meeting, an individual spoke up about the unfairness of compulsory integration. I agree that compulsory integration, a form of eminent domain, should be an area of concern. Not perfect, especially if you're opposed to natural gas harvesting. It effectively takes away the landowner's right to choose. It is also important to recognize that compulsory integration is governed by the state and not the local authority. It is not an issue that can be controlled locally. But the bottom line is they are justly compensated for what is taken by the law, the state. Okay. A moratorium solves all these problems I just mentioned because it takes away your deeded rights okay, for free. Worse, it's not taken away by the state. It will be taken away by a local municipality. People, this should anger you. A moratorium seizes your mineral rights. This concern should reach across all sides. You purchased your land as free and clear from the center of the earth to the sky. I do not care if you have a square foot of land or a thousand acres, or if it's in the town or the village. Are you going to be the one to explain to your grandson when they ask you, Grandpa, Grandma, where did they, why did they take your mineral rights away? Well, Sonny, I signed this, excuse me, I signed this yellow piece of paper from a nameless, faceless group hiding behind anonymity, and we didn't understand that they sent around all this misinformation, and it scared us. And now our mineral rights are gone forever for the price of a stamp. First, it's a moratorium, and this is how it works, folks. First, it comes down as a moratorium. The town stated it would be a year. This yellow sheet of paper is pushing for 24 months. We have two years. Then we have a ban, okay? And your mineral rights are gone. Again, this doesn't matter what side. This reaches across all. We pay taxes on this land. Are we gonna be reimbursed to the beginning of our deeds? This is crazy. This is our deeded rights, and we all need to protect them and a moratorium takes that away. Let the state make the decisions. Thank you.